So you bought an Arduino or a Pico and turned on some LEDs, but no one is impressed. Let's look at some mathematically advanced projects that you can build using just LEDs. For these projects, we will use an Arduino Uno R4. Wi-Fi board which has an inbuilt 8 x 12 LED matrix. Basic knowledge of Arduino is assumed. Number 1. The Drunkard's Walk. Ever wondered how particles move randomly in a fluid? Let's simulate this using an LED matrix and a concept called the Drunkard's Walk. We start by placing our walker right in the middle of the LED matrix. Every 200 milliseconds, our walker makes a random choice to move in one of four directions. Up, down, left, or right. If the walker would step off the edge of the display, we stop them. They need to stay within bounds. To make the movement more visible, we leave a trail of the last five positions lit up, like breadcrumbs. The current position is always lit up while the trail shows where we've been. Number 2. Bouncing Ball To create this effect, we start the ball from the center of the LED matrix with a random velocity vector. Then, in each frame of the animation, we calculate the ball's new position using physics equations that account for gravity. We also check for collisions with the matrix boundaries. When a collision occurs, we reverse the velocity component and simulate a slight loss of energy. To keep the ball moving, we implement a kick system that activates every 5 seconds. For natural looking motion we track the ball's position using floating point numbers, but round to the nearest integer. Number 3. Visualizing Wave Interference Patterns We place two invisible wave sources on our matrix Imagine dropping to pebbles in a pond. Each wave spreads out in circles from its source, just like ripples in water. As waves travel, they get weaker with distance, just like a real wave. When the waves meet, they combine. This creates bright spots where waves add together and dark spots where they cancel out. We find out the amplitude of the resultant wave at each point and turn on the LED if it is positive, otherwise it is turned off. Number 4. Cyclone. To create a pattern similar to a cyclone, we draw three arms of light, each spaced 120 degrees apart. Each arm starts out from near the center and spirals outward using an exponential function. We avoid the center to create the eye effect. All the arms rotate together, and we add tiny random wobbles to make it more realistic. The frame is updated every 50 milliseconds to create a natural looking cyclone with turbulence. Finally, we visualize quantum teleportation. We start with a quantum state appearing as a glowing point, which then creates an entangled connection with another location. The state gradually disappears from its original position while simultaneously appearing at the target location with the interference patterns showing the quantum nature of the transfer. The code uses wave functions and probability distributions to create these interesting patterns by rendering the quantum entanglement effect on the LEDs, giving us a glimpse into the strange world of quantum mechanics. We hope that you found the projects interesting. Please share your ideas in the comments below. And thanks for watching.